Let's start with derivative of trigonometric functions and sine function is always our the starting point. So question here is find the derivative for the following sine functions. So we are given y equals to sine x over 5, y equals to sine square x, y equals to sine 3x and y equals to sine 5x minus pi by 2. Let's find the derivatives. So we can say dy dx is equals to this basically if you see it is 1 by 5 times sine x correct that is what the function is 1 by 5 is a constant so 1 by 5 will come outside dy dx and we say derivative of sine x with respect to x right so derivative of sine x is cosine x so we get 1 over 5 cos x so that's the answer so that is how you are going to find derivatives and we can also write dy by dx as y dash. So I am going to use that for solving the next problem. So we have y equals to sine square x. So what is dy dx equals to? dy dx will be 2 times sine x, the power rule, right? 2 times sine x and then the derivative of sine x that is cos x. Now 2 sin x cos x. At times you can simplify this and you can write this as sin 2x. If you remember 2 sin x cos x is sin 2x but either way is correct. Now the third one is y equals to sin 3x. So what is y dash equals to? y dash is derivative of sin 3x which is cos 3x right? Times the derivative of the angle so which is 3. So we can write this as equal to 3 times cos 3x. Now the next one is y equals to sine 5x minus pi by 12. So y dash is equals to cosine of this times derivative of inside function. Now derivative of inside function is just 5. This is a constant. So let me write it straight. 5 times cos of the angle given which is 5x minus pi by 12. Right? So that is how you can find derivatives of sine function. Now next sheet we will take up derivative of cosines.